I spend my Saturdays on campus. So. Uh, I'm off to the library, the not so aesthetically pleasing one because the law library is closed on weekends. So I'm gonna go there and study. Probably gonna be here the whole day until tonight. So no. Go to pick and pay because I need to get bread. I don't buy bread. I buy burger rolls because I don't finish my bread and then it expires before I finish it. So yeah. This is a very quick and easy cookie recipe. I literally only use three ingredients and I've been using this cookie recipe since last year. I haven't baked in a while, which is crazy, but I'll get back into it. I was planning to write my test at 5 a.m. because usually when I'm writing psychology, the test opens at 5 a.m. and I write within the first hour or two hours, depending on how long the test is. I woke up at 3 a.m. to revise my work and to also do a mock test. I fell asleep, literally fell asleep with my PC in my hands. So I was just so tired. I haven't been getting a lot of sleep because I've just been studying a lot. I did wake up. I woke up quite late, um, but the test was still open. After doing my mock test, I wrote the test went well. I actually finished quite quickly. <laughs> you know, when you finish your test so quickly and then you just kind of wait because you don't want it to look dodgy. Now, sometimes that happens to me. <laughs> when i was in high school i always used to write concession then when i got to university like i finished very quickly but i also just think it's because in university as much as it's a lot of work you kind of have enough time to study as long as you just manage your time correctly so yeah i had tea but i didn't have breakfast last night i cooked some mac and cheese for dinner so i'm just gonna have that while working on some posters that i have to do for psyche do you actually like to break them i don't know are you supposed to break them i'm not sure on my way back home there was a mental health awareness um poster on campus and it just asked me to write down what I'm feeling at that moment and I found it really helpful because I'm generally the type of person who needs to write something down in order to get over it and I always just appreciate such cute initiatives. tutorial. <laughs> Give me 
painting. So I'm gonna come back and study. I'm just gonna take my ink a quick break. Hello! How are you? Who closed the window? So I came back from campus about an hour ago from the library. And right now I just want to clean the shelf and reorganize some things. Might be going home this weekend, so I also just want to pack some things and take them home. Most of the things are still on my bed. I just put everything on there. But I still need to organize. I've been listening to music all afternoon while cleaning. I find that to be very therapeutic. Yeah. I don't know. My Bible is also blue. <laughs> I'm folding some of my clothes. Chloe says I have a lot of clothes. And I don't think I have a lot of clothes. But I low-key think I do. I'm just thinking of giving some of my clothes to my little sister. As much as I'm older than her, some of them would fit her. Um also gonna donate some of them. The psyche always has donation drives. Or I'll just donate some of the clothes to charity because i'm also trying to revamp my closet some things i have but i barely wear i like pistol colors and neutral colors it just keeps me sane because i feel like when my clothes are too bright i'm too visible <laughs> like people notice me quickly and i'm not trying to be seen <laughs> someone also asked me to do um a weekly outfit video and i'm definitely considering doing that so i will do that so for dinner i decided to make some turkey and pasta because we are gonna have low chilling and i think turkey is one of the quickest things to cook um pasta as well so <laughs> i generally also just enjoy being in the kitchen because i absolutely love cooking so this week i was honestly happy and I'm just glad to be cooking and baking again because I feel like myself again. <laughs> I don't know if it makes sense. Sure. I'm planning to do my assignment that was posted yesterday. It's probably going to take like an hour to finish the assignment. I just up for Chloe because she's writing tomorrow and she was feeling a bit stressed and sad about her test. When I spoke to her yesterday, I just wanted to make her feel a bit better with a home cooked meal. But she's not picking up her phone. I'm guessing she's still at the library, she's studying. But I hope she responds before tomorrow because otherwise the food won't taste the same anymore. And it won't be the same because she already wrote her taste. <laughs> wake up in time and i prepared in time as well but the problem comes in when i have to pick an outfit <laughs> i changed like 10 million times just wearing a jean white beanie and comfy shoes i am late for class so we'll talk later i haven't even had breakfast and i'm hungry so i'm gonna have some gum 
So I have breakfast after my lecture. And it's good. I didn't even open the window. The weather is so weird today. And I'm sad because I called Tiamo and Tiamo's not coming to school. I'm back home because I didn't eat and I'm about to have breakfast. I only had one lecture. I'm doing someone's hair on Friday, so I quickly want to go and buy um, the fiber, but I'm going to do that after eating. And then I'm probably going to go back to the library and do some schoolwork when I come back. This morning, I honestly just woke up and did my assignment because I had a 7.30 lecture and then I came back and finished my assignment and submitted it. I'm going to do Fifi's hair today. I'm doing people's hair, but my hair is looking like a mesh right now, currently, but it's okay. We will fix it eventually. <laughs> Something in the garage. My face is not giving. Why is still water more expensive than flavored water? This is so weird. 